Hi guys, happy Wednesday. Thank you so much for tuning in on this Wednesday. Um, it has been a while. I'm going to kind of let you guys roll in, but I hope you all are having an amazing Wednesday. It's been a while since I've done a live, so I'm super excited to have you all on here. And my audience is building and loading, so I'm super excited about that. But I'm just going to jump on in here. Hi guys. Um, it's been a couple of weeks since I've done a live. Welcome to Wednesday, Wisdom Wednesdays with Lindsay. I'm so excited to have you all here. Um, it's been a crazy week. I don't know how your guys this week has been. Mine's been great. I'm finally back at it, working 24/7, which I love. I have been out of commission doing some medical stuff, so life is good. Hi guys. I hope you guys are having a good day and a good evening so far. What I wanted to talk to you guys about tonight is character. Can care can character bring good prosperity? Before we jump into that, um, I wanted to share with you guys my motto, which is she believes she could, so she did. And a lot of people do not know that this is what I live by. If you ever feel down, if you're ever having a rough day, think of this. She believes she could, so she did. Because if you do that, you're more inclined to stay motivated. I love this quote, like I keep saying, I have good stuff coming with this content, so stay tuned for that. Um, the as you notice, as you will notice by the title, can good character or character bring prosperity? Absolutely it can, and here's why. Do any of you know what character is or having good character? If you do, comment below and I will read them later. If you do not, just say no and we'll go into it later, which is perfectly fine. Um, character is The mental and moral qualities um, that an individual, of distinctive qualities that an individual has, i.e. they are motivated, they are driven, they are passionate, they work, their worth ethic is outstanding. It's amazing. They have to have, in order to be successful, you need to have good character. Hello! Um, and in order to have good character and to bring prosperity into your life, you have to be a positive person and you have to have character within yourself that not only just shows the world who you are, but it also has belief behind that. So with that being said, I made some notes because that's just what I do. Um, what I wanted to bring to you guys is I put on Facebook today, my quote of the day, which was basically talking about, and I'm going to kind of pull it up here on my iPad, and like I said, if you guys have any questions and want to shoot me for next week's Wisdom Wednesday with Lindsay, please do, but while I'm pulling this quote up, what I wanted to ask you guys is, do you believe good character can bring prosperity, and if so, why? Comment them below, and I will look at them later. Um, What I'm doing is I'm pulling this up, but I also wanted to see if you guys were having a good week. If you are, say yes below. Okay, the quote that I had said today and posted was, She changed her cans into cans and followed her dreams and made them into a plan. Took her dreams and made them into a plan. I kind of butchered it a little bit. Life happens. So, when you take yourself with a good character and you're positive, you're driven, you're happy, you're more inclined to bring prosperity, i.e. money or i.e. good friendships, good conversation, when you exude that amazing energy. So, with that, I just showed you guys a quote. Um, let's see, I just need to flip this over. Um, for example, so one of the examples I wanted to give you guys tonight was, for me, I'm an online entrepreneur, I posted this today, I used to not even know where I could work because of my unique and different circumstances. If you do not know, um, I am an advocate for Beautiful People, Beautiful Minds on Facebook, you can like that and follow that or find it. On Facebook, I also have Beautiful Unique on Instagram. Go follow that, like it, and like any of my posts, and I will comment back with you. Um, And that is for people with unique and different circumstances. So many people of unique and different circumstances have amazing character, but they're not praised upon it. So with that, my job is, on top of being an online entrepreneur, is to share that with the world and show that their character is not just because they're different. It's because they are amazing human beings, and we need to look past that. So... For the example of bringing prosperity with good character, I work my butt off as an online entrepreneur and to have prosperity happen to become that, I had no idea what I was going to do. Three years ago, I posted about this today. If you guys have not seen my post, 
go check that out. But what I had posted today was if you do not have a if you do not know what you're doing, you have to change your path, change your life, change what you're doing to create something different. Hello. Um, and what, how does that happen is you find your dream, your passion, and your why. So many people, what I've noticed is a lot of people, um, excuse me because my allergies, but a lot of people have been wanting, wishing, or dreaming to become something bigger and better. How do they make those dreams, wants, needs happen? They either act on them, number one, or number two, they don't do anything at all. And they just wish that they were doing what they wanted to. Or they're watching someone do what they wish they had done ten years ago, five years ago, a year ago, today. That's the key thing that I wanted to talk about. So, for example, when I started my online entrepreneurship and just this dream to advocate for people with unique and different circumstances as well, I had no idea how I was going to build upon that because... Within my business, it's based around seeing people and meeting people and traveling to people. Could I do that? No. Hello. But what I could do was create a system that worked for my needs, not just mine, but others as well, and share the same opportunity and share the same amazing things that I learned and taught myself with others. So by doing that, I was allowed and I had the blessing to show people that anything is possible. I was able to show them what I took from what I couldn't do that I felt at that time to what I can do and still do, which is why I say she believes she could, so she did, which is why I talked about it today. Um, When you take what you can't do and turn it into a can, whether it takes you seven months like it took me to create a system and formula that works for my needs as well as others around me, it works. It brings you prosperity. And not only that, it changes who you are as a person and builds the character that you already have into something bigger, better, and most important, just a happier person. So, with that, let me go to my next sheet here. Um, Establishing a good credibility. When you establish good credibility, you are working towards having people who believe in what you do, believe in what your job is, love who you are, and love where you're going. I have multiple people in my life and who I surround myself with who not only believe in me, but see progress can be made, i.e. technology, i.e. just sharing people the passion that I have. So when you build that credibility, I can sit here and tell you, my name is Lindsay Mozetta. I'm an online entrepreneur. I'm also a graphic designer, and I'm an advocate for people with unique and different circumstances. Three years ago, I couldn't have done that. And so with you guys, when you guys are speaking and learning and talking and growing with people, you want your focus to be on your credibility and building yourself up. A lot of these like-minded people, hello, that I work with, that I get to know and I get to learn from, build so much credibility because they have established themselves, learned, created, motivated, and built momentum within their businesses to be something bigger, better, and most of all, to allow others younger than them to look up to them. So with that, good character can absolutely happen, and even character can bring you prosperity. There is this thing within football, if we will, for character. A lot of people will sit here and tell you to have good character, you have to be able to fall down not once, not twice, but at least five times, if not more, to be successful. Yes, no. If you agree, like, or put a heart, that'd be great. And if you disagree, that's okay. But you have to be able to fall down, create credibility, create something amazing to be bigger, better. Tonight, not only this, I've been really realizing and being taking a step down within my job, within my life, I have decided to for my medical self and just to rest, to look from a different perspective. If you notice on my Instagram, Beautifully Unique, go like it, go follow me. You'll notice that I had on there, I had posted, and I think I posted it too on Facebook, I'll check. But if you take a second and you don't know where you're going, you don't know what you're doing, or you're having trouble figuring out how to become something better than what you want to do today, that's not to say what you're doing today is not good enough. You want to become better close your eyes and think of a new perspective or take a new look, a view on things. That being said, what are you going to do about it? 
How are you going to build your credibility? How are you going to bring prosperity? If I had not chosen to believe in myself and take seven months out of my business and time to create my business and make it bigger and better, I wouldn't have been where I am today. I took time and invested my own situations to review things and to change differences and to make my business better. So I built better character, I built credibility, and I gained some amazing prosperity, not only just financially, emotionally, mentally, that I never thought I would in my life. And that's why I wanted to teach you guys today with Wisdom on Wednesday, when, ugh, Wisdom Wednesdays with the Lindsay is that you can do anything you want, but you have to have a foundation for that and have to have a... Um, passion for what you do and what you love if you don't love what you're doing don't do it anymore stop change it do something different build upon yourself reinvest in what you're doing to make you a better person I know I do I learn a lot I will sit on my bed and read a psychology book or learn more about my business learn more about what I can do to be a better person because I want to so Do you guys believe in or agree with what I'm saying? And as well, what I had mentioned before on my quote today of turning your cans into cans and turning your dreams into reality is take those cans and take those dreams of what you wish you want, you wish to have, what you want to have and what you may need to have um, into reality. Create a system, start writing down your goals, start writing down your dreams, start writing down your visions for what you see, not only for yourself, your family your friends around you, and you as a person. Because when you surround yourself with people who not only love you, believe in you, and want to learn from you, you're going to do amazing things. There's no doubt about it. And so that's the thing that I wanted to share with you guys tonight. Because not only that, I'm so passionate with what I do. I love advocating for those of unique circumstances and working with those of unique circumstances. I love being an online entrepreneur. And through entrepreneurship, I learned to love graphic design. I learned to love just the character building exercises that I get to do. So with that being said, I'm going to see what you guys have been saying. Uh, Flip it around. Where's my magnifier? Um, If you guys have any questions too, please ask me because I am more than happy to answer them. Um, And also, if you guys have any questions about how I became an online entrepreneur or what the reason why I decided to do that please do you guys can ask me anything um thank you so much for the positive comments I love seeing them like I said I have been out of I miss seeing you guys I miss talking to you guys it's been so long um I've been taking care of myself medically which is great I'm now back to full in full session I work from 1 a.m to 1 p.m every day so I love it life is good um, let me see what else you guys are saying. It's good to see you all. Let's see here. Oh, let's see. Thank you so much, Kirsten or Kirsten. I always like say your name wrong. I'm sorry. I love you though. Um, yeah. So what's crazy is when you start to, let's see my little magnifier thing is being silly. Okay with unique and different circumstances and with having and I had somebody just text me this question because they saw me on live um which for me it wasn't the fact that I had an opportunity brought to me it was the fact that I knew that this was the perfect opportunity of being an online entrepreneur to help others become something that they might not be able to see within themselves Um, and it was also to motivate others who might not have a chance or have an opportunity to do something in a unique and different way with my help and with my guidance and and along with others that, um, allowed them to feel comfortable, if that makes sense. My friend who had texted me and the question was, do you or have you ever, do you or have you ever understood or knew what your purpose, passion, or why was before you even started being an online entrepreneur. Yes, I knew that when I was 16, 17, high school, junior high, and knew that me being different was a purpose. There's a passion for it. Me having some medical ailments, there's a purpose for it. There's a why. Don't know why yet, and I'm still learning that. 
but with Wisdom Wednesdays with Lindsay and just sharing with you guys some of these things that I've experienced, I hope it gets something out of, you guys get something out of it. I hope that you guys learn a lot from it because not only has it helped me sustain my life financially, it's helped me grow in so many ways and also it's helped me build character. Like I said, character is something that we all deserve to have, especially good character. Never in my wildest dreams have I met somebody who has even the slightest of bad character um, and who takes their times of pain or trial and turns them into a purpose and a why. So that's really the goal and that's really why my friend Ryan had texted me and said, hey, what what is your question since he's on live right now? Um, that's the goal, guys. And like I said, I know it's kind of jumping everywhere, but I wanted to jump on here because within the last few weeks, especially since I've been resting more, I've seen a lot of things from a different perspective of people saying they can't do things or this is not happening, this is not working. Are you acting on it? Are you taking those cans and turning them into can? Because if you think about it, what are the last four letters of American? I'll let you guys comment that below. I'm not going to answer it. Hopefully that will give you guys some insight and yeah that's all i really had to say for you guys today i hope you have a wonderful day and enjoy the rest of your week as we go into friday it is may I'm super excited a lot of you guys are getting ready to go into summer and finish class so congrats to you all and again thank you so much for taking the time to watch me on live i miss you guys and i'm so glad to be back and i will talk to you guys soon like i said please like my page beautiful people beautiful minds Go follow me on Instagram at Beautifully Unique. If you need the URL or link to that, please message me and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.